am preparing to go to a jackpot barrel race. I am preparing tonight. compression stockings you can also put ice in them I've got like the second layer you can shove I like to put popsicles in them because they're easier to clean up now we have to back my trailer up I'll show it to you guys right here. It was a mess. I'm like really gross right now, but hello, my little chickies, and welcome back to another vlog. Today is Wednesday. Well, tonight is Wednesday. I'm here at the barn, obviously. I already rode, and I already braided his hair. It's on the other side, but I don't have my tripod, and there's like a little ledge right here. I didn't record me riding or anything because I rode outside and it's really dark out so you guys really couldn't see anyway. But I am preparing to go to a jackpot barrel race tomorrow with my friend Kenzie. Um, it's tomorrow night, but I am preparing tonight because I don't know, I'm extra, I don't know. <laughs> I saw on TikTok and I don't know who did the video and I'm so sorry I don't know who did the video. I didn't look, I just saw the video. Somebody said if you soak your polo wraps, in water that it makes the poultice last longer. So I'm gonna try to do that. But now I'm kind of second guessing myself because it is chilly tonight. I don't know, maybe if they're just damp, I'll just wring them out. I don't know, now I'm like second guessing myself. Is it too cold to do it? I think it's supposed to get down in like the 30s. Shoot. Maybe I'll just put the poultice on, but let me show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so I already soaked his polo wraps. These are just like really long wraps that you wrap around their legs and Velcro them on. And I have them soaking in water, but they're to help protect their legs in the trailer or so you can put poultice and stuff on and it helps keep it on better. It also works as like compression too, but I have compression stockings. I use the brand Hides for the compression stockings, but I don't have those with me. So I think I'm just gonna do poultice and not wet them because the water's really cold and I don't want him to be cold. And it's pretty, I mean, it's not super cold. I don't know. Maybe I'll try this in like the spring and summer when it's not dropping into the 30s at night here in Indiana. Um, but I do have to brush him because I let him out in the arena and he rolled and now he's all like, I don't know if you guys can see that dust on camera, but yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how I put the poultice on. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen me put poultice on. Um, this is what I use, the Ice Tight by Horse and Health Products, I guess is it. I get it at Tractor Supply. And then I put this, ooh, it's leaking. <laughs> I put this Rainmaker on his hooves because his hooves chip really easily. He's so ready for bed and to go eat some of his hay. So I'm gonna do this really quick and I'm gonna show you guys. I am also going to be putting some of this liniment on him. I also got this attractor supply. It's like icy hot for horses, but I'm gonna put some of this on his back just because, I don't know, I want him to feel as good as possible when we go to barrel races and stuff. Like I want him to be as comfortable as possible and not sore like at all. Not baby. Right. He's got his poultice on. Oh, you're block you're blocking the view, sir. 
He's got some hay that he's stepping in. Why are you stepping in it? And yeah, mane's all braided. Let me see if they'll let me show you. Oh, it's so dark, I'm sorry. There's no like light in his stall. But he's all ready for tomorrow. Hi guys, and happy Thursday. We're here at the barn. My mom is, oh, I can't zoom, but you can see her right there. She's playing with Hustler. Um, but I'm walking to my trailer to go grab his halter because I left it in the trailer last night. But we're here, I need to get him all ready. I need to put his hide boots on and everything. Hustler's got his hide boots on. They're compression stockings. Help with any swelling or anything. You can also put ice in them. They've got like the second layer you can shove. I like to put popsicles in them because they're easier to clean up and you can reuse them. Put in his little tail bag. I love this tail bag so much. I got it from Purdy and Polos. <laughs> oh my, somebody's angry outside. Got his hair braided. Are you ready? We're so excited. So, so excited. Now we have to back my trailer up. My mom's gonna do it, I, I gotta guide her. All right, come on. Yeah, straight back, go. Straight back. Go that way, just a little bit. Straighten it up. Straight back. Go that way, just a little bit more. Stop, stop. Oh, I gotta raise it up. Am I even going up? <laughs> I don't know. This is so hard to do. Hold on, I'm gonna set you guys right here. Hopefully my mom doesn't take off because <laughs> I need both hands. That way, just a little bit. No, just do it as you come back, just a little bit. Inch it back, a little bit more. Stop, good. Stay right there. No, we gotta go the other way. just a hair. Stop, stop, stop. Why is it not going on? Oh, damn. <laughs> there it went. I got it, guys. <laughs> that was crazy. I didn't pull. Yeah, we're good. I didn't pull this little lever back. I forgot. <laughs> that was my oopsie. This is quite the arm workout. Holy cow. I am rolling it up. Ouch. Okay. Well, I forgot to pull the thing back, so it was just sitting on top, and then I pulled it and it dropped. Ouch. You're fine. That's what I forgot to do.
Sorry, you guys, my mom forgot to hit record, but, um, I hold on, I gotta get back there. Yeah, you got lights, but we got it hooked up and everything, so we did it. Now we gotta go pick up my friend. And we're running a little bit late, but we're always running a little bit late. <sighs> but yeah, I know it wasn't recording at all. You gotta make sure you gotta hit that little red button. your friend all right you guys well we were running a little bit late and now we're running a lot late because I forgot my bridal at my mom's yeah so now we have to go all the way back to my mom's with the trailer and grab my bridal Ugh, I'm such an idiot I literally thought I had it with me and I put it in the truck but I guess I didn't I guess I left it right on the table and I took it home with me because I wanted to put my new bit guards on, the cheetah print ones. So yeah, now we're running really late. I already texted my friend. She hasn't answered yet, but I hope she's not mad. I doubt she'll be mad, but we're trying to hurry. Hi guys, we made it to the jackpot. I'm in the bathroom, I need to pee so bad. Um, but I thought this would be my last chance to talk to you guys because this show's not that big. And. I'm really nervous, I'm gonna have my mom videotape, but I'm also really excited.
lighting's still not that great. It's still so dark. We made it home. We dropped off my friend and oh, Hustler's rolling again. I put him out in the arena so that he can like stretch and roll. He's somewhere back there. Where is he? He's right there. He did really good. I didn't push him a whole lot because it was dark in the arena. And honestly, our first run, he, I'll show it to you guys right here. It was a mess. But the light that was right there blinded him and he just kind of like freaked out, which I'm not mad at him about. I mean, it happens. He's still got pets and treats and stuff. But yeah, he was just like blindsided by it. That's never happened, but he's never run in the dark like that. So yeah, now I gotta take his braids out and his tail bag out. And I already got him some food and some hay. He does so good. Oh, I'm shaking the camera a lot. But he did good. Now next weekend, we are so excited for the next. It's a super show. So I'm like super excited. But I have a lot of fun. I'm glad I got to go with my friend. It made it less lonely. Cool. But here, my mom's going to record me taking all this stuff out. Sorry for the lighting, but um, I'm getting ready to back the trailer up because my mom, she can drive it, but she can't back it up. And I'm scared to drive on the interstate, but I can back it up. <laughs> so that's why you make such a good team. But yeah, I'm going to back it up. I wish I could show you guys, but it's dark. So I'm just going to tell you. All right, you guys, we made it back to my mom's. Um, I think we're going to head home tonight because I like just really want to sleep in my own bed. So, I'm gonna head home tonight. Yeah, I keep looking that way. I don't know why I keep looking that way. But I put my hair up in a bun and I'm getting my bags packed. Not packed, just sipping them back up. They're really already packed. <laughs> Dylan and my grandma, her great grandma, are watching football, I think. Um, but yeah, I had a blast going tonight. Um, first run was definitely, this never happened to me before, but I mean, it happens. So um, I'm not mad about it. He was kind of blindsided going into that second barrel, like the light. But his last run, he did really good. I'm very proud of him. I'm so excited for next weekend. Um, but I think I'm going to end the vlog here, but I hope you guys enjoyed this little come to a jackpot with me vlog. I don't know what I'm going to call it a show, but, um, I keep seeing, saying, but, um, like every time, like every five seconds, uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video and I love you guys so, so much. Bye. Bye.